name is Ilani Colts and I just wanted to shoot an update and let you all know what's going on in my world. So you may have come to a People for God Loves You conference in 2015 or 2015. You may have gone to Eve Within conference in 2016. But now my family and I have moved to Arizona and we love it. It's been an average of 75 degrees every day and we adore it. However, we've decided to open up a series of retreats during this time where for the Eve Within retreat, it would be for women who are either searching for or already know their purpose. You have an idea, you have a dream, you have a goal, maybe you even have a revelation from God. And all you need is time to really focus in on that without the worries and cares of everyday life, without waking up at such and such time to get the kids ready for school, without waking up such and such time to get certain things in order for your business or for your um, place of employment. You will have this weekend to really focus in without those distractions, not that they're not valuable or important, but sometimes we just need time to get away, hear from the Lord, have time to write, have time to actually go through that process of starting your business. For example, I don't know about you all, but oftentimes I'll have a million tabs open of things that I'm gonna to get to later. So this weekend's the time to get to all of those things and make sure that you are fulfilling the call that God has on your life and not using work or family as an excuse, this is that time to focus in. We will hear from people who are well established in their various fields to help walk you through that process. And thank you all so much for opting into this mailing list for these updates. In addition, I am launching You Are Not Condemned, You're Single which is a book that is coming out this June 2017. I'm looking to start a small group online of about six readers or so who are interested in reading a portion of the book, giving me feedback, engaging in discussion with me, and writing a review for the book um, after that point. So if you are interested, please let me know by responding back to this email. Let me know if you're interested in a retreat for the weekend. Um, on dreaming and on purpose. Let me know if you're interested in joining a small group. And finally, so William and I started Thrive in Life, which is a community for couples. Right now it's online. We're looking to make that an in-person thing. What we're looking to do is interview couples that we admire, interview uh, couples who've been married for 25 years or more, and also just engage in community. So often people go through life in relationship and that relationship is in isolation. So the things that you're going through, you think you're the only one going through that. Things that your boyfriend does, you're the only one that does that. Things that you're going through as a wife and or a new mom, you think you're the only one who struggles with those things. And it is so comforting to know that you're not the only one, that there are so many people around you and that there are people who have mastered how to deal with those very things that you're going through in your relationship. Wouldn't it be wonderful to glean insight from those specific people? So we're looking to establish online community where we're having interviews and mentorship, that kind of thing. But we're also looking to have thrive and online retreats where you and your spouse can come and just engage in the communication and activities, have a ball, and also just get away again with the commitments that we tend to have at home. It's a wonderful opportunity to just get away with your spouse, get to know them, get to build your friendship with them because though you're building a life together and though you have all these different things that you are, um, you know, called to do all these different roles, it's a wonderful thing to, to get to 40 years down the line and say, wow, I still know you. I still know who you are. We're not starting over now that our kids are all out of the house. We've been developing this friendship and this relationship over the course of time. So, we are able to just revel in the fact that our house is empty now. If you're interested, just send an email and I look forward to hearing from you all soon. Have a good one.